All right, 180.2. Only dropped 0.1 from yesterday, but it'll be lower tomorrow. I'm pretty sure. Uh, it's 11 a.m., so I slept for a while on Sunday, and I'm just gonna get ready, make some protein pancakes, and uh, I'll show you guys how I do that. So basically these are the ingredients. Uh, I got two bananas so I'm going to mash in this bowl. Um, I'm going to do 1.2 grams of baking powder, not baking soda. I'm going to use four large brown eggs and two scoops of the chocolate coconut uh, protein because I want to try it out. Um, so basically you just mash the bananas to where they're, and whisk them up to where they're smooth. Uh, crack in two eggs, 1.2 grams of baking powder, two scoops of protein, and then you're good to go. And then throw them on a on a griddle, and uh, I'll show you guys the finished product. There's the finished product. <clears throat> Pretty good amount of food. Top it with some of this, and I'm gonna take it upstairs. I'll go over the macros and everything. All right, so. Some syrup. And try them out. It's delicious. Um, so let me go over the macros. All right, so the macros for this are 64 protein, 44 carb, and 20 fat. Two of those are from my fish oils, so. Really good macros. I'm going to eat these and probably go to the gym an hour or two. So I'll check in with you guys then. Yeah, taking the toll road today. I don't feel like going the long way. It's a nasty day though. And we're on our way to the gym. It's three o'clock. Chest and triceps today. And I'm thinking about maybe picking up a pizza after the workout. I don't know about like a Papa John's. I might pick up like a DiGiorno's or something so I know exactly how much I'm getting calorie wise. I'm still staying in the deficit today, but I'm really craving a good pizza. And the one I had, the one I made yesterday was good, but it's not as good as like a dish window or something. So uh, I will uh, check in with you guys when we get to the gym. Big Tex, about to start chest day. I'm gonna use one of these. I have a bunch of samples of stuff, so I just gotta try something different today. So C4 50 times, chest day. Let's go. Pretty good environment, it's fucking, it's pouring behind me. 
classic Texas. It was sunny yesterday and beautiful, and today it's raining. It's gonna rain for the whole week. So that's sad, but uh, we're gonna move on to uh, the decline hammer strength machine for three sets of probably 10 to 12. Slow and controlled reps, really putting a good squeeze on the chest. Um, but yeah, feeling good today. I don't know if it's that C4, probably not. I've heard that stuff sucks, but uh, yeah, let's head over to the hamstring. It's gonna be uh, cable flies from top position. Um, yeah, as with every movement, just focusing on really squeezing at the bottom. Well, this movement at the bottom, but um, for three sets of 10 to 12, depending. So let's do it. Three sets of 12. Uh, it's great when no one's here because I got my phone plugged in, so jamming to my tunes today. Uh, next movement's gonna be close grip dumbbell bench press for uh, three sets, probably actually four sets of 10 with uh, just 35 pounds. Don't wanna go too heavy or you break form, so let's jump into that. Cardio done. I just did 15 minutes on the treadmill. It's like a mile and a half, something like that. Um, yeah, it's 5:15. Go to HEB. I was gonna pick up Papa John's, but it's just it's more expensive, and I don't know how many calories are actually in it. So uh, I could guess. They have a nutrition calculator, but it's not gonna be exact. But um, so yeah, we'll head over there and uh, 
Yeah, so there's my gym right there. And literally right next door. I don't know if you can see that. Right now, because it's raining. It's the worst footage I've ever put on my channel. But there is a place called Pizza Paradise. That apparently is really good, and it's the biggest tease whenever I walk out of the gym. It's literally right next door. And sometimes the garage is open in the back of my gym, and the smells from the pizza place just waft over. And there's an Asian place right next door. God, it's brutal. Once this prep's over, I'm getting myself a pizza after the gym. All right, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys at HEB. All right, threw on a hoodie. I didn't take my camera in HEB because it's still raining pretty hard. So I didn't want to even take a chance of damaging it. Um, but what I picked up is one of these HEB Classic Creations. It's a thin crust. It's like... I forget how many calories, but it's not gonna put me over my caloric limit at all. I'm still gonna have three or 400 calories to work with. And then six of those flavored waters, which are probably gonna be my new addiction for the at least for the next six weeks on this cut. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go inside, make this pizza and chill and just do what I always do and watch Netflix. All right, so I ate the pizza already. I was watching some TV with my parents. Um, <clears throat> but the macros for that pizza were 116 carb, 52 fat, and 60 protein. Um, that puts me at 1,800 calories for the day. I'm probably going to finish off with a Quest Bar or some rice cakes. I haven't really decided which one. But um, yeah, that's where we're at right now. I'm just going to shower and hang out. Hey everyone, it is pretty much 8 o'clock. I'm going to finish off with the pumpkin pie quest bar. Um, just to get some more fiber in my body. So that'll put me at about 2,050-ish calories. So again, lower than normal. But uh, tomorrow I'll get back on the routine. Um, and yeah. That's where we're at. Um, I'm going to end the video off here. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the morning.